What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is the chick coming at you with another gold making video. Today I'm going to show you guys my route in Scarlet Monastery. This is my favorite farm to do for transmog, makes me a lot of gold, made a video running 50 times showing the loot yesterday so I figured I'd show you the guy uh, the way I run it. So uh, I'm running this, just run over here, swipe these guys down. I would advise doing this on a druid or a demon hunter or something with crazy good move speed. Uh, you want to pop your move speed cooldowns every time you can. Uh, when you're using a druid, you want to use skull bash and stuff to help you move quicker. Um, you'll want to use stampeding roar on cooldown. You don't really have to loot the bosses. Uh, you just have to kill them to open the doors. And when you make this run, you don't kill everything in every room because when you're going around the circle, it keeps you killing stuff and you're always moving. Uh, ideally, you would have bear Terratar on but I don't have any at the moment. I didn't think to grab any before I came out here. Uh, but when you come into this room, I go left. It doesn't matter if you go left or right, you can do it either way. Um, the results are the same. Hopefully we get a good piece. Hey, there's a decent one, 2,397. That's uh, not bad. Not really YouTube luck, but it's not bad. Uh, like I said, you wanna make sure you're using like Skull Bash and stuff if you're uh, a Druid. Um, you'll be dashing around if you're a demon hunter, if you are a warrior or whatever, you'll be leaping and charging like crazy. Rogues just sprint on cooldown. There's anything you can do to make yourself move faster. You can one shot this on anything, so just take advantage of whatever class you like to run around on. I like doing the druid because they get uh, passive move speed, plus the energy mechanic makes it easy to just keep swiping um, you can also do that with a subtlety rogue or an assassination rogue it's not real beneficial to do these runs on an outlaw rogue because on outlaw you don't have a, an instant aoe like you do with um, the other two specs and once you go around you go in there and you kill like i said i hang to the left and just make a circle once I get into that room. You, know, you skip the last boss because all the RP would just be a pain in the butt. It would just take you too long. And if you skip looting the bosses when you kill them, you will get the loot in the mailbox later. I would suggest just uh, doing this on an enchanter so you can disenchant everything you get. That's not worth anything. I haven't really got a lot on this run. It's kind of turning out to be crap, but that's not why we're here we're here to show you what's going on and it took me a whole three minutes and 25 seconds to complete that and we made 2400 gold anyways that's the route I use in Scarlet Monastery I'll be bringing you guys another video pretty soon probably SFK or some other crazy good farm that I like to do until then I'll see you guys in the next one and happy gold making